Hello my fellow Pokemon trainers, today I have here the uh, Pokemon Paldea collections. Uh, Fue Coco, Quaxley, and Sprigatito, all three of them, will be, we will be opening them up uh, today. Um, it's going to take, it's going to take a few minutes to actually get everything out of the packaging. Uh, but pretty much in each of these, we get a uh, jumbo redacted uh, card of one of the two box legendaries. Uh, we got a pen of one of the starters. Uh, we got three promo cards um, with two different artworks, depending which which boxes you do get. Uh, and I believe four booster packs in each. Um, so let me go ahead, take everything out of their box, and we'll go ahead to check in everything out. All right, here is everything out of their packaging. Um, so in the Quaxley, we, we got his pin. Pretty cool. I started out with Quaxley myself. Uh, I did consider... Fue Coco to begin with, uh, but what I like to do when I start my games is that I take a starter, I make a team around them based on what, and I was say new Pokemon are in the game, and uh, Quaxley gave, gave, me, gave me the better all-around team than to Fue Coco. Um, I know my sister started out with Sprigatito, so I will be giving her this cool pin. Um, and the both the Quaxley, they can come in either, either or, it doesn't matter which one you get. Um, but in my Quaxley and my Sprigatito box, I got the Maridon EX Jumbo Redacted card. Uh, I say redacted because there is no type. It doesn't have a type. Also, there is no energy cost, as well as no weakness, resistance, or retreat cost. Uh, but it just have the ability and the move, how much damage, and what it actually does. That's pretty cool. Looking forward to actually getting that card when the set comes out. Um, and then in my Fue Coco box, I got the... Uh, Coridon EX. Uh, again, it has no type, as well as no energy, weakness, or retreat, or resistance, anything. Uh, it has a cool... Uh, I think out of the two, Maridon EX is the better, going to be the better one competitively. Uh, I'm pretty sure this is electric, this is going to be a fighting type. Um, once during your turn, you may search your deck for up to two basic blank Pokemon. I'm pretty sure that I think it's going to say electric, if I'm not mistaken. And put them onto your bench, then shuffle your deck. So that's pretty cool, and that opposed to uh, Maridon here, or Coridon, that was Maridon, that was a Coridon. Um, once during your turn, you may, you may set, once during your turn, you may attach up to two basic blank energy, I'm pretty sure that's going to be fighting cards, from your discard pile to your basic bank Pokemon, I think it's going to be fighting, uh, in any way you like, after your ability, the turn ends, it's like, eh, it's good and all, I can attach energy, but the turn ends. Um, unfortunately, weirdly, you can see on these jumbo cards, there's like this line that just goes down the middle which is weird um anywho let's actually go ahead and start opening up oh before we open up the booster packs let's take a look at the promo cards we got so in Quaxley here we got a the regular Sprigatito uh there's two different versions of all these promo cards I'll be showing those in a second uh we got Foy Coco and then we have the exclusive uh Quaxley promo uh, but when I take a look at the Fuecoco ones here, you'll know why. They're all different. Um, so here in the Quaxley, you'll be getting this one in both the Fuecoco and the Sprigatito box. As to the Quaxley one, you'll be getting this artwork. It's all pretty cool. Um, also, you may have noticed, for those who don't know, the borders are now uh, like this nice gray silver color as opposed to yellow. Um, for the Pokemon Scarlet and Vi Violet uh, booster packs going forward. All the yellow borders are now going to be silver or and slash gray uh, to match the Japanese cards, which is very cool. Uh, very cool. So you see here with the hollows, you'll get this nice rainbow sheen, and the regular ones will have like like a grayish silver onto them. Um, oh, then we have a Sprigotito, same one that came with Fue Coco, and then or Quaxley, and then we have this Fue Coco artwork, which is indeed different. Uh, to the one that came with the Quaxley box. Also, you can tell the moves The moves are also different. In my opinion, I do like the artwork on the regular one as opposed to the promo. Uh, both have the same HP. And also the regular one, I think, is slightly better competitively because of that extra 50 damage. And also you can still attack with when you have one energy on opposed to this one where you can't. I mean, it's burned, but yeah. Um... There are those. Now in the Sprigotito one, 
Again, we have that same Fue Coco artwork, regular Quaxley, and then now we have the other artwork of Spurgatito. Also, uh, HP is the same, uh, just attacks are also different. The one that comes with the box is Mini Drain for one Leaf Energy, 10 damage, and Heal, heal 10 from this. And the other one, Scratch 10, one Energy, and then two Energy Leaf, Leafage for 20. Tell me which one is your... I like, I do like this artwork better, but this one might, again, is probably better. Competitively, and then same with the Quaxley artwork, which one do you like better? I kind of do like uh, the promo one, just because the background is also good as well. And, uh, yeah, I guess it's also slightly better competitively. <laughs> All right, so those are the promo cards there. I have those off to the side. I will be probably sleeving up everything kind of later. Uh, first, let's go ahead. Let's start opening the booster packs, starting with the Quaxley box. Let's see which box is better to get packs out of. All right. Uh, now, now in these in, in the boxes, you do get four booster packs. Uh, you get two Silver Tempest. That was the recent set. That makes sense. And then two Brilliant Stars, which was uh, a few sets ago, if I'm not mistaken. Right, because there was Last Origin and Astral Radiance before that. Uh, I'm not sure what other ones other than the Pokemon Go. I think those are the two. Uh, so weirdly, brilliant stars. Uh, I'm not mad about that. Anywho, uh, let's go ahead, open up these booster packs, see if we can get anything good. If we can get that alternate art Lugia, that would be everything. All right. All right, Quaxley, what do you have for me? All right. Uh, Metal Energy. Matang, Anorith, Unidentified Fossil, Beldum, Krogunk, Solossus, Zubat, Fungus, Reverse Murkrow, and ooh, a Magirna V. All right, well, we got one V so far from the Quaxley box. All right, so a Brilliant Stars. I don't assume to get much out of these. Maybe one or two hits per box. Because that's usually... Ooh, V-Star Marker. Because uh, that's usually what we get from these things. All right, so we got a V-Star Marker instead of the energy. Uh, Goodbye. Torkoal. Double Turbo Energy. Like, one of the three energies, the few energies that are still going to be in rotation. So that's nice. Ooh, Halucha. That's an... Weasel, Gibble, Trap Inch, Cast Form, Reverse Nose Pass, and a regular Breloom. I thought I had a black board. I thought I was going to get something out of that one. That's very. That's very interesting. Well, I don't know what these borders mean anymore. Um, all right then. Uh, Silver Tempest. So maybe it's the White Borders from Brilliant Stars. Because I know the White Borders from these ones, we don't usually get, uh, get anything, do we? I'm just really confused. Now, uh, Lightning Energy. Torquette. Krillia. Gym Trainer. Maniri. Chimeco. Amolga. Vultix. Dreepy. Reverse on floor and a regular kill you. Alright, last pack from the Quaxley. It is a brilliant stars. Don't get anything out of this one. I'm highly doubting it now because it's giving me this one. It's the same as the other one. I'm really confused now. I'm really confused. I really don't think it's anything because unless I got an error pack from that Breloom there. I really have no idea what 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 what's what what's what anymore. Uh, fighting energy, executor, choice belt. That's not bad. Got to hold on to those because we don't have the powerful energies in rotation anymore. Staravia, Shanks, Impidimp, Golette, Cast Form, Chimchar, Ooh, Reverse Marnie's Pride. That's cool and. A Rear Mewtwo. All right. Well, we got one V. We got a V so far just out of the Quaxley box. That's one regular V. 
That's can we beat that? I would hope so. All right, now out of the Fue Coco box, starting out with Silver Tempest again. Can we get anything good out of you? One, two, three, and four. All right, so Metal Energy. Just all my cards are kind of, yeah. Uh, uh, Worker, Sunflora, Primordial Altar, Blink, Stunfisk, Togedamaru, Esper, Lytton, Reverse Misrubus, and a, another Keldeo. All right. So let me just tidy up my cards here, get them in a nice stack. Okay. Uh, Brilliant Stars. We get anything cool out of you. Oh, that. Okay, well, there's that. I probably already used this up. And from what this card is telling me, I don't get anything good out of you. Uh, one, two, three, and four. Unless my, unless I'm missing something. Um, Psychic Energy. Sharon's Care. Another Durable Turbo Energy. All right. Uh, Torkoal. Burmy. Riolu, Magmar, Impidim, nope, Axio, Reverse, Carablast, and, ooh, a Gold Magma Basin. So what the heck were those two packs from the Quaxley box, giving me the black borders and nothing? I pull the black border out of this one, it gives me a Gold Rare Magma Basin. Well, all right then. So far, the Fue Coco box is in the lead. Okay, I'm going to be sleeping up everything later. I didn't have time to get my sleeves. Um, Silver Tempest. Can we get anything out of Hue? One, two, three, and four. Da, da, da. All right, we have a Fire Energy. Gym Trainer. Sigilith. Serena. Morga, Vulpix, Dreepy, Redem, Swirlix, Reverse Dupiter, and a regular Verizon. Alright, our last Brilliant Stars pack. Can we get anything good of you? Probably not, but who the heck knows? One, two, three, and four. All right, Leaf Energy. Cynthia's Ambition, Crown Zenith, Alt Art, come on. Full Art, whatever. Uh, Torkoal. Another Double Turbo Energy, my goodness. Electabuzz. Halucha. Buizel. Trap Inch. Execute. A Reverse Lapras and a Regular Star Raptor. All right, Fue Coco. You're coming in the lead with that gold magma basin. Weirdly, it fits your type perfectly. All right. Sprigatito. What? One pull. So far, it's been one hit per box. What will Sprigatito give me? Will she give me the Lugia? Come on, I got two packs to find out. One, two, three, and four. All right, we have our Leaf Energy. We have a Stone Journer. We have a Golbat. Fury Sewed Girl. Fungus. We have a Sandy Gast. Relicanth. Halucha. Rufflet. A Reverse Crobat and... Hey, a Hollow Crobat. That's that's very interesting. Please don't be. That's the only good pull. That's very uh, very cool. Very interesting. I kind of like I kind of like having the reverse and the Hollow right after that. Um, all right. So that is what Sprigatito has given us so far. Can we actually get like a uh, another V full art? Anything else? Anything better? Come on. One, two, three, and four. Another Leaf Energy, a Choice Belt, all right, Luxio, 
Gloria. Sock. Ooh, that's some cool artwork. Cherubi. Riolu. Starly. A Spiritomb. A Reverse Cafe Master. And a Meg Mortar. All right. A second to last packs out of all of these. Silver Tempest. Come on, Sprigatito. You can't just give me a hollow crowbat and nothing else. Come on. Ooh, maybe we can get something out of the Brilliant Stars. Alright. Fighting. Energy. Worker. Sunflora. Primordial Altar. Swirlix. Marini. Indidi, Maldoy, well, a Zonkard, Reverse Dragonite, and a regular Combellion. All right. All right, our last pack is Brilliant Stars. Come on, can we get anything good out of you? Code cards, I have no idea what they tell me. That's probably, probably bad. I think all we're going to get is that Crobat. All right, so Psychic Energy, Sharon's Care. Bear Tick, Collapse Stadium, Halucha, Weasel, Trap Inch, Gibble, Cast Form, Reverse Roseanne's Backup. That's, that's actually not too bad of a card. Choose one or more. Shuffle Pokemon from your discard pile into your deck. Shuffle a Pokemon tool card from your discard pile into your deck. Shuffle a Stadium card from your discard pile into your deck. Blah, 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 blah. It's not bad. And a Cling Clang. Well, all right. Well, my opinion, Fue Coco was the better box to get. Um, I got a gold uh, Megla Basin out of there. I'm pretty sure that paid for at least one of these boxes. I really have no idea. They're like thirty dollars each at the moment for I, where I am. I have no idea how much this Magma Basin costs. Um, it's not a card I consider. I'm considering playing at the moment. Uh, but perhaps maybe in the future, if a fire can get a pretty good deck going, this is a not, they're, I think they're working up fire and electric at the moment to be good decks. Um, cause what, what was it? Magma Bank. So once during each player's turn, that player may attach a fire energy from their discard pile to one of their benched fire Pokemon. If a player attached energy to a Pokemon in this way, put two damage counters on that Pokemon. Hmm. Okay. This can, it can be good with some decks. Who knows? Who knows how good fire decks will be in the future? Who knows? This could be a good card. It's going to be around for a couple of years anyways. Um, but yeah. So, if you did enjoy this year's video, please indeed leave a like. Comment your thoughts down below. Let me know, in your opinion, which box was better for me. It was Fue Coco. If you did open up all of these boxes, which one, uh, which one, which good box did you get? Um, also, do let me know. Um, if you have any information on what these code cards even mean, because you saw I got two blacks, um, from one of the boxes, and they were, I think it was a Claxley box, they were both duds. It was like a Breloom and a Mewtwo, like what was that? That's a lie. I don't, I don't trust the colors on the backs of them anymore. Uh, but yeah, I got, Fight Coco was my better box. Let me know if you did open up all of these, or if you opened up one of them, what pulse did you get, how good they were. Um... Please indeed subscribe and turn that there bell notification on so you do know when my next video is up. Next, my fellow Pokemon trainers, if I'm battling, catching, hatching, good luck opening up your packs. Hope you get some good spicy pulls. Whoa. Um, Till next time, Sinara.